Hey, it's Brock here from Rock Hill Farms. And today, I'm gonna haul some dirt and try to do some land leveling. So, the only thing I've hauled in the new dump trailer so far is rock and wood. And I know how much rock I can fit in here. If you level it all the way across the top, you've got 16 tons of rock, and I can only haul about four. The trailer will haul five, but the truck will haul four. So, now the question is, what about dirt? Because if I'm going to pick up dirt, there may not be a scale there, and I don't want to put, you know, eight tons in here, 10 tons in here, and not be able to dump it or not be able to haul it. So, on Google, it says dirt weighs about 2,200 pounds a, ton, uh, a cubic yard, and I can fit six cubic yards. So, based on that, I can still only fill it about halfway with dirt. Now, this morning, what I'm going to go pick up is composted manure with straw and wood chips in it that's been sitting a long time. I'm going to get a load in here, take it and have it weighed, and that'll give me an idea for future reference how full I can get this. And then we're going to bring it down here and some areas I've worked on in previous videos need leveled out. So, should be a fun day. Let's get going. Looks like good dirt to me. take a walk around the rest of this property real quick. I've shown this uh, farmer before loading hay and stuff. And they mainly do hay production, but they've got horses and, and some other farming too. Pretty standard what you'd see behind a horse or a cow barn. The center of that's gonna be good usable topsoil and the parts that aren't fully composted will till into a garden. So I'm gonna just keep making loads back. Today I'm just taking one load because they're busy, but just keep taking loads of this, move it to my property. Um, I can till it into gardens or use it for whatever I need.
right, well, I was hoping to guess or estimate how much I could put in here and not overload it and came out just right. So I mounted up about twice as much in here as what I had in rock and then I went and weighed it. it weighs the same as the rock did. We're just under four tons which is right at what I want to haul. So lucky guess I guess but it worked out great. Now over here I've got my firewood that's already split. Next to that is the pile of logs that need split. Then I've got a brush pile and when my three-point mulcher comes in I'll have a mulch pile next to that. Next to that I'm going to have a composted dirt pile. So if a customer wants a garden tilled but they'd like some some uh, rich dirt added into it I can bring some. Garden beds I can bring some mulch although at first I'm probably going to use all the mulch I can make down around my Christmas trees. But I'm setting up kind of a raw or a materials area down here. I've got a bunch of areas around the yard with ruts in them that need filled in. I thought about trying to tailgate that out in different spots all over the yard, but it's been rainy so I might just make more ruts with the trailer and have to fill those in too. So I'm just going to dump it all over here, then I'll use the tractor to spread it around different places in the yard where I need it. So let's get going. Do you want to talk to the camera? Come here. This is how we'll do it like this. We'll go. You can see yourself right there. This is Oakland. She likes to help me. Do you have anything you would like to say, Oakland? Yeah. Oakland. <laughs> Oakland? Are you a helper? Um, yeah. All right. Well, let's get to work. Can I help you, Papa? Can I help you with your sweater? All right. What we have here is composted manure that's set out for years. Then it's got straw and whatever else kind of debris in it from the, the horse stalls. So for my needs, it's perfectly fine. If I'm selling a job to someone else and plan on using that, it's all about communication. You tell them exactly what you have and if they want to use it, fine. If not, I can get some dirt from somewhere else.
right, so we had a bunch of holes over here where I pulled out a barbed wire fence that was right here and there was a bunch of uh, small trees and bushes and stuff here. I ripped all those out with the stump bucket and then I was working over here when it was kind of muddy and I made a bunch of tracks and uh, this whole area was just rough. So I used about half that pile. I put a little bit on the other side of the house and then did this and that used up about half the pile that I delivered today. I'm gonna run up, I've got a bag, a couple bags of this uh, like seed, feed and weed combo thing. So I'm gonna go get the spreader and spread this and should be an improvement. So I appreciate you taking time to watch this video. Just a minute, you'll see links on the screen to a couple more of our videos and I'll see you next time.